I really like those two dots in the S, the very last S. Those are really good dots. Yeah, this font in general is really good. And I'm going to remake the joke. Oh, God, but I've forgotten what joke it was. No, Mal, we can't. We can't keep doing this. We can't let people know that we sometimes restart a recording. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, hey, everybody, I'm Tony. My pronouns are they, them. I'm Mal, my pronouns are also they, them, and this is a good-ass font. Yeah, so today we're playing All Our Ages. Uh, this sent to us by Sean Han Tony, who is uh, the person who made Even the Ocean, uh, along with another person. And that was a good-ass game that we enjoyed on the channel. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to doing this one as well. Yeah, same. It was, yeah, that was a solid fucking game. Damn. And so immediately we're having flashbacks, by the way, to uh, even the ocean uh -huh. as we have the storyteller. <laughs> yes. Uh, so I will be doing uh, basically every miscellaneous role <laughs> and the narration because Mal is sick. So. Yay, that's me. Oh, the storyteller begins to speak. A place with 4.4 .4 billion <laughs> humans, multifaceted cultures, intertwined histories of conflict and cooperation. What would you call this place? Well, in reality, we call it Asia, a tiny term for a large place, if you ask me. If you are reading this in English, it's likely you grew up outside of Asia. Even so, your relatives or ancestors might be from Asia. If that's the case, you and the protagonist of this story, Yuito, share something in common. You're both Asian. But, hmm, wait, Yuito is Japanese American, a man, well off, and works at a hedge fund. Does it mean anything to say you're both Asian? Or to say you do Asian things? Or to say you support Asian causes? Those are big questions. And I wrote this story to try and understand some of them. So let's start. The story will begin inside a dream of Yuito's, doing the tutorial. Woo! God, I do so many uh, game tutorials in my dreams. Oh, absolutely. Oh, I like that uh, Sean called it press the cross button. I'm, I'm into Aww. that. Uh, I, I forget which, is that like a pal thing? Like uh, like basically anywhere not the, shoot, um, anywhere that's not the US. What, what is the other region that uses, um, yes, 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 I can look up. There's, there's some other region that uses the, the same terms and shit as the U.S. I always forget which place it is, though. I don't have any idea what you're talking about, so... That's okay. I clearly <laughs> have no idea what I'm talking about, either. Yeah. Uh, the human figure begins to speak. Yuito. Yuito! Can you hear us? Nope. No, that's all right. Uh, also, we are playing this on our original PlayStation. Oh, yeah. Had to, had to dig that thing out from under our house because we buried it there um, just after the incident. Uh, but, you know, we got to do what we got to do for the channel. Yeah, we're really sorry that it worked out that way, Chaz. Uh, can you hear us? <laughs> Another human figure begins to speak. Yuito, it's me, your father. Ba -ba -ba. Come and meet with that person. Although, I'm not going to lie, the, this like lighting right here is pretty sick. Like a, P a PS... PS1 could never do something like this. Oh, yeah. At least, oh, God, I don't yeah. think so. Uh, it's been a really long time since I played any PS1 games. So uh, I don't know if I could tell you either. God, was fucking Cra Crash Bandicoot was on the PS1, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, God, I love the shit out of the Crash Bandicoot. Oh, I mean, yeah, because it was good for yeah. its time. I personally don't think those games aged very well. I mean... But I think they were still pretty good for their time. Like, I like them a lot. You know what? Just because something doesn't age well doesn't mean it no longer has value, Tony. I disagree completely. If it doesn't oh. age well, you should throw it in the trash. What? So if I get all wrinkly when I get old, you're going to, like, trash. you're going to, like, slam dunk me into a garbage I, I, can? I'm going to three-point you from half court into the garbage Shit, can. Shit, Tony. It's Rude. <laughs> it's Wednesday morning, two days after Yuito's dream. Yuito is in his Chicago apartment, speaking on the phone to his mother. Yuito, are you seriously thinking of going to see him again? Forget about that asshole. It's just one of his schemes at redeeming himself. I know, Mom. I mean, I agree with you. It's unforgivable for what he did to us, leaving after I was born. I'm not going to give him redemption. But the memory world procedure. This might be my only chance at meeting him. I need to go. But that procedure is dangerous. It's still experimental. The doctor said it's pretty safe as long as... Maybe that doctor's just saying it's safe. You don't know. 
It's pretty safe as long as I don't stay too long. And if you do stay too long, then what? <sighs> I don't know. You're only thinking about yourself, Yuito. But it's my life at stake here, not yours. Don't worry. Mm, don't worry? Yuito, you're unbelievable. But... Look, I don't want to start a fight. Not now. Just be careful while you're in there. Promise you won't stay too long. Okay, I'm sorry, Mom. It'll be quick. Love you. I'll call you when I'm done. Yuito hangs up the phone. 31 years ago, in the late 1990s, he was born in the USA to Japanese parents. The father was transferred for work. The mother, a second-generation Japanese-American, was a medical researcher. The two met in Japan. Each day, Yuito works 9 to 7, holy shit, and then returns Jesus. to his downtown Chicago apartment. He picks up a letter from his father, sent from the hospital. I know I can't apologize for a <coughs> lifetime of being absent, but please, if it's okay, forgive me enough to visit me, at least before my illness progresses. The previous day, Tuesday, Yuito visited, but his father was already unconscious and unlikely to recover. In his father's memory world... <laughs> I, I like this memory world machine already because this is this like exactly fits like some general themes of the previous two games that Sean has made. Yeah, <laughs> like, it feels it feels really apropos for like a PS1 type game, too. It, I don't know why. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. Anyways, it's, it's just fun. It's, it's so interesting to follow a developer, I think, over multiple games. Anyways, uh, let's see here. In his father's memory world, Yuito hoped to learn, or meet, anything about his father. Knowing there will never be a second chance, Yuito signs the waiver, travels to the hospital, and after speaking with the doctor, enters his father's memory world. Bum bum bum. I like how the title just keeps appearing on the bottom right. It's almost like it's whispering to you, All our ages. It is. Have you not been hearing the whispers, Tony? Oh, I hear the whispers all the time. The granny whispers? The, did you say the granny whispers? Yeah. The, the what? Granny. Granny whispers. What does that mean? Is that a term? Is that like a phrase? It's just a reference to over the garden wall. Oh, okay. Yeah. You're very disappointed. I am For disappointed. some reason. All right. The checker room. A space between reality <laughs> and a person's memory world. Connecting to hospital. <laughs> oh yeah, anytime you see dashes, can you make those noises, yeah. please? Uh, connected. The doctor speaks. Uh, Yuito? Hello? Doctor, where... As I discussed, you are in the checker room. I'll open the memory world entrance now. I talk like this, because I have a PhD, and uh -huh. no one can stop me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Yuito. Remember, if your dad dies and you're still in the memory world, you'll die too. Oh, <laughs> damn. So while your navigation pod makes it easy to get around, it's better if you don't stray too far from the memory world entrance. Remember, what you see may shock you, but it's all just a visualization. Don't panic, as an extreme mental state might damage your father's. I'll see you when you're done, Yuito. This has... This is already, like prone to all sorts of nightmare bullshit. Yeah. I would never in my life want to go into anyone's mind. Yeah. Anyone's Definitely. mind. Especially in a machine that makes like fucking weird dial-up noises as it connects and that you might fucking die like Inception style. Oh, absolutely. Like like this this just sounds like the nightmare zone. Oh, this is so neat. Yeah. So, Those particle effects are really good. I really appreciate it too because it seems like it's like a cone it seems like it's a texture i don't know i i i'm really appreciating the ps1 uh style here because i something i feel like uh is very specific to um to like uh, older like older consoles and really just any older media is its flaws and really emphasizing those flaws and using those flaws to make it a more interesting artistic experience yeah that's how you do it yeah for oh. sure all like understanding it. the limitations of your medium and like using those to your advantage. Yeah, exactly. Instead of trying to like cover them up or hide them. Right. Yeah, it makes like a more authentic product and just in general, I think. Uh, incoming message for you, the player. Interact with <laughs> interact with the well in order to save your game. Again, you may access sex. Uh, you, you may access sex. Oh, so don't don't go too far into your dad's memory. Yeah. Oh boy. 
I'm I'm just saying that it's it this is the nightmare scenario. <laughs> That's that is true. I I def oh no, I'm not gonna make that joke. <laughs> Alright, so I guess we're going to the right. What do you think the well represents? Uh well it is the save point. Mm -hmm. Right? Uh and water is life. Water is life. Water is life. Classic. Yep. Look at our little thrusters. I know, they're real good. They I like are our real little good. pod. Are like, is Yuito in the pod or is Yuito the pod? <laughs> One of these is. Whoa! True. All right, we have an exclamation point. That's not mm -hmm. an exclamation point. No, at all. it's just a window. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Oh god, Tony! Oh, I thought oh. we were gonna like fall really far for some reason. Oh no, Mal, did we need to ta have you take the Dramamine pills? What? Mm, uh, we'll find out. <laughs> But we, we sure will find out. I want to jump down. No, you're not allowed to, Tony. No I, shortcuts. I want to jump down. Maybe whenever I'm rotating, just cl keep your eyes closed, okay? Never. Oh, all right. Well, that's fine. Yeah, it I, is fine. I like our boosters because they look like little feetsies. I know. <laughs> They're great. <laughs> what a weirdly cute pod design. I, you know, I saw like video and screenshots of this pod and I was like, oh, it's fine. It's a pod. But I'm so charmed by it right now there's, and I don't know why. There's something about seeing something move that really, I don't know, does something. I agree completely. It reminds me, I saw this, um, like, just like a short clip of an interview with fucking, um, Oh God! What's his name? He's Finn. Finn. Sure, the voice actor. No, the actor from the Star Wars movies. Oh, Finn? oh, John Boyega. Yeah, yeah. John Boyega. Thank yeah. you. Talking about how like he knows that BB-8 is not real or alive, but BB-8 continues to move between takes and like does shit. And oh. so like he'll just be like walking across set, and BB-8 will just be like going by, and he'll be like, "Hey, BB-8," and BB-8 will be like. Bloop, 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 and be like, oh, see, yeah, see you, bud. That's the best. Yeah. Wow. Okay. A building? Right. A lot wow. of the memory world resembles real life due to my father's latent memories. So there might be people in there. Who knows? In addition, there are places called memories, places that are strongly themed after highlights in a person's life. Doctors said memories are sparse in dying patients, but I should still search for them. Mm -hmm. Seems like the nightmare scenario. Like, yeah. you're gonna go in there, it's just your dad having sex. No! Tony, Shit. why? Because that's, I'm just saying, that's like the worst possible thing I mean, that could happen. I mean, that's fine, but this game might be highly personal for the developer. Don't talk about his dad having sex. No, not the developer's dad having sex. Okay. <laughs> Hi there. I was wondering if... Oh, something in uh, Japanese. I can't speak a word of that. Nope. The traveler turns away from Yuito, ignoring him. Oh, let's save our game. I recognize like three or four of those characters. There's wow. E. <laughs> There's she. A cheerful woman begins to talk. She is standing from a stack uh, with a stack of cards meant to be stamped at various train stations. A bunch of things we don't know. Uh, wow, a lot. A lot. Um, I don't speak Japanese. <laughs> Awkward. Card. Yours. Stamp. The woman makes a stamping motion and offers Yuito a card. No, I'm okay. Oh. Awkward. <laughs> God, Yuito, way to fuck that up. Well, we can't unless we get a card stamped. Yeah, I guess we can't go that way. Okay, I should stop trying to immediately go like where I'm not supposed to be going. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk to this person. Hi there. Uh. Two travelers turn toward Yuito. Uh, some words in Japanese. God, I can almost says. read that one. The second chimes in. Some other stuff in Japanese. And more. Sorry, we do not speak English. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Let's keep going. Oh, look at this hallway. It's such <laughs> a cute hallway. I do like, like, the subway tile texture that's going on in the floor. It's good. Because like, we're in a subway. Huh, oh, God. 
Don't don't talk about Be Subway. Fresh. I've, I've had too many Subway sandwiches for work lately. Oh no. Because it's so convenient oh, when you God. have like ten minutes to go out and get something. Yeah, but that is almost part of what makes it cursed. Right. Yeah. Exactly. God, there was this one shoot I did in Eastern Washington where, because it was Eastern Washington and we need to get food fast, to, there was a we got Subway twice in one day. And, and it was like there's some, like I think Subway is fine if you eat it once. Subway is fine. Subway is fine. But if you eat it twice in a day, there's just something ultra depressing about that, and it, I hate absolutely. it. Absolutely. Uh, there's a person standing at what looks like an information booth. Hi, I'm looking for memories. Do you know where I could find any? <laughs> Yuito, you're such a fucking dork. <laughs> <laughs> wow, he's just being straightforward. H- hello. Uh, words. Oh, uh, do you speak English? No, no, English. Uh, all right, then. Okay. Well, oh, wow, there's a lot of people to talk to. <laughs> yeah. The secretary looks at Yuito. Uh, do you speak English? Hmm. <laughs> Never mind. I feel like Yuito should have expected this. Yeah. Yuito approaches a man with a large backpack. Hi, I'm looking for memories and... English? You on vacation? Because there aren't any memories here. Gotta go outside. But I'm guessing if you've tried to leave, they haven't let you yet. Yeah. You'll need a permit. Uh, Just say this to the lady at the help desk. She'll get you started uh, on the application process. But then you'll need to go to the permit office to get signed off and filled. Filed. Oh, thanks. Wow, a helpful backpacker. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Um, what? Okay. Oh, can you go in that room? Uh, let's... Yeah, sure, let's try this room. I don't think so. Oh, no. An old-looking guard turns to Yuito. What? More words? I'm sorry? The guard points at the exit and then crosses his arms into an X shape. Ah. I don't think I'm allowed to leave. Yeah, we're not allowed to leave. All right, so we have our first puzzle. Yeah, we've got to go... No, downstairs, the help desk. I know. Oh, wait. No, you're right. Uh, the worker hands Yuito a piece of paper and pen through the booth. Uh, here? Yuito points to the paper and makes a signing motion. Uh. Ah. Uh, you sign. Yuito signs the paper and slides it back to the worker. The woman stamps and returns the exit permit to Yuito. Uh, thanks. Okay. So, I, th- I think that's enough for us. I know it. I know it said that we have to go talk to us some other thing. Okay. No, 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 no. I think we can't leave through here either. I think we've got to leave maybe somewhere else. Okay. So there was the shoot. I already forgot what the backpacker said. <laughs> All right. So Yuito points to the permit. Um. Yuito nods. He points to the permit. <laughs> Yuito hands the man the permit. Incredible. Um, thanks? The secretary nods his head and smiles, stamps it, and makes a copy. He hands the copy back to Yuito. I hope there's no more Japanese after this. Where are these memories? Dude, Uh-oh. you're in your dad's you're in your dad's mind brain. <laughs> Alright, so we just kinda waltz on through there. Oh look, it's just a black wall. Yeah, and I'm just going to turn it into a black wall momentarily. Oh yes. Mal is still very, very sick. Alright, there's errant snow. It seems we're in a cold... Ah, yes, the cold place. I like how there are these vague suggestions like that this is a sign. It's a convenient sign. This way back to the highway and forest. Stay left for the highway. Otherwise, keep on your right for the forest. Behind you is Advent Station. Or so the sign says. Alright, so Mal, do we want to go to the highway or the forest? The highway. That's a really good question. Or the fall. Fo- I really like forests in video games. I'm leaning towards forest. Yeah, personally. I think the forest is more interesting, but I imagine we can probably get good game stuff from both of them. That's true. And if this is anything like even the ocean, you'll be able to like pretty much beat the game and then also traverse back through the entire game if you right. want to. Man, there's a. If uh, if when you buy that game and then uh, play through it all, like and unlock the. 
there's like a sort of like a developer extra section mm -hmm. at the very end where you get to go through like all the level a bunch of the levels in like their early development and get the like commentary oh, yeah. and everything. I did that off screen and it was super interesting. I highly recommend it if you're a big fan of even the ocean. Uh all right, into the forest we and go. You should be because it's a good it's a good game. It is a good game. Wow. This is my kind of forest. Like Mush a miasmic fog with like giant mushroom like trees. Hell yeah. Oh man, Mal, you said that uh, you've never had mushrooms before. Like, uh, excuse me. Like, like portobello or like um, criminy or. Um, excuse me. Like, like, have you never eaten a mushroom? Tony, I love mushrooms. Oh, okay. you, you are well aware of this. Oh, okay. I'm... Oh, water. Whoa! Wow, good looking water. Too. Yeah, damn. Real good, some real good PS1 water we got there. Yeah, I can feel the PlayStation overheating from over here. <laughs> it is actually kind of warm in here, which I am surprised about. It is kind of warm in here. Well, I mean, because even after, well, we have a space heater and it's very quiet. But even after we turn the space heater off, it's like an oil-based space heater. So it like, keeps going. For a little bit, yeah. So, I don't know, it's just the way of life. Mm, it's the way of the... Song of life. Can I go over these hills? Nope. I doubt it. Yeah. You can. Oh! Yeah, you're fine. Oh, okay. Oh, are That's... you sure you didn't just get stuck on the tree? See, honestly, it's hard. It looks kind of like you maybe just got stuck on the tree geometry. Oh! It's honestly hard to tell with these PlayStation games. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, That's fair. Oh, look, a building. That looks like something. Uh, Ooh, pe it, pebbles. It almost looks horrifying, though. Mm, yeah, a little bit. All right, yes, oh. two triangles. Yuito is thinking to himself. Man, it's been miles and still nothing. I hope I haven't gone too far. Two guards stand at the booth. Stop, sir. Uh, yes? Because of vandals, only those with permission can proceed to the forested canyon. The second guard speaks up. It's it Judy, as Judy says. I'm sorry, but we have orders to not let you in without a certificate of reason. Well, I've got a reason right here. I need to get through, so let me through. Uh, Jenna's right. To be honest, you don't look like trouble, but this is my job. Jenna stares at Yuito. Yeah, it's mine too. Get out of here. Give me a break. You really get paid to stand here? Isn't it just a hiking trail? Judy laughs. <laughs> Orders, kid. Then how do I get permission? Go back to Advent Station. Present a history of your past crimes and places of employment, as well as a proof of intention for your plans in the canyon. I don't have time for that. God, no one has time for that. Hmm. Jenna, what do you think? Or, or uh, I'm starting to forget which one's which. It's okay. Jenna pauses. Uh, well, if you want to take the blame, fine, go ahead, says Judy. Jenna nods her head. Yeah, and maybe show some respect while you're at it. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, goddamn. What's even going on over here in this canyon? N um, nothing. I mean, except for vandals, apparently. I mean, I guess we're about to find out. <laughs> oh, it is such a canyon. Yeah, oh. God. I don't know why I'm so impressed by the really basic, but lighting effects on the pod. Because it just looks good. It just looks good, damn it. Memories. What's this that even entail? God, that doctor is useless. Memories are supposed to look abnormal, but when everything is abnormal, Ugh, I don't know. Just need to keep looking. No idea how much time I have left. Sorry, Mom. I swear I'll be done soon. Mm. Something tells me that we're going to have a bittersweet ending. Uh, yeah. Like, I don't know how, like, whatever ending is possible in this game, I don't know how it won't be bittersweet. Yeah. All right, do we go up the ramp? Quick, Mal, quick. Yes oh, or no? Sorry. Up, up, no, not going up the ramp. I mean, right. I guess not. I mean, we can in a minute because I don't think we're gonna see anything down here. But I mean, it does look like a wall ass wall. Sure does look like a wall ass wall. Oh! Uh, oh no! Now we can go down. Huh? It was not a wall ass wall. Good, well, good for us. Well, Wait, actually, no, but what's in the middle? It's just. Oh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> water. You can just kind of hang out in the water. Yeah. Oh, I what's did. that? I don't know. It kind of looks like Shiny. something. Or it doesn't quite look like something. It's honestly hard to tell. Yeah. Play, PlayStation. Oh, PlayStation. Who's your good PlayStation? Or PSX? You know, 
Honestly, I never un wow. Can no, I not go no, back? No, you can't. Damn it! I never understood why it was called the PlayStation X or PSX. I I should I, look that up. I don't even know quite what you're talking about, honestly. That's what is a right. PSX? Oh, uh, that's what this what the system was called. Oh. Like like it was you know PlayStation. P I like I don't know. I'm sure I could look that up like with a quick Wikipedia search. Like, comment, subscribe if you think that I'm just being ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, that's true most of the time. You just pass the ramp. That's because I wanted to get a good running start at it. Ah, I see. Ah. I always forget that we have momentum in this game. Uh, I always forget that, too, mostly because we don't. So mm. I, I just keep forgetting about right, it. Right, yeah. Makes yeah. sense. <sighs> you doing okay over there, buddy? Yeah, I'm doing a G just fine. That's the sound of a mal being really sick. Woo! I mean, at least I'm well enough to actually record a Let's Play. That's true. Which I was not there for a hot second. Yeah, we've uh, we've been having a little bit of difficulties. Chaz is on in the nightmare mess at work where he's just working every day for ridiculous hours. Like 12 hours or some bullshit. And mal almost died of sickness. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, that's not true, but I did get pretty sick. Uh, I, found a, I fell down a well the other day. You did not. Although I did have a dream last night that you fell down the stairs at our new house. Mm -hmm. uh, Was it a good dream? I mean, <laughs> no, you fell down the stairs, Oh, okay, Tony. good, good. I was, I was going to be like kind of hurt if you had said yes to that. <laughs> I was I was like, like, Tony, are you okay? And then you were like, I don't know. And I was like, did you hit your head? And you were like, I don't know. And I was like, who's the last president? And you were like... Obama? And I was like, okay, well, you oh, can't be too bad off. Oh, shit. I fucked up. You fucked up, but at least we can kind of fly, sort of? Oh, but I'm not on the ramp anymore. There Fuck! Oh, Tony! That's all right. Tell me more about how, how I was a president. Oh, yeah, and then you just turned into Obama. Like, in a good way? And I was like, you were still not great because presidents are just bad in general, but, God, I sure do wish you were still president. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the, those Obama feels. Yeah, those those weird, weird Obama feels, I would say. Oh, oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> how do I make feelings about, like, a leading political figure? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All our Asians. <laughs> Asa. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> oh, bless you. Man. Oh, God, I forgot. And then you just turned to me and you went, Asa, Asa. And as you were doing it, your eyes got bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger until it was all I could see, and then I woke up. Were they still presumably in my eye sockets, regardless of how big they were? Um, I think that's something the viewer is going to have to decide. I see. All right, it's up to interpretation. Wow, where are we going? Oh, we're, huh. we're looking for memories, Tony. Oh, shit. Wow, I almost fell down there. Ah, platforming. Look at this platforming mess. Mm-hmm. It's beautiful. I like how any given wall, like, is just Whoa. a door. Wow. Mm. What is this? I used to have memories just like this. Mm -hmm. Bouncer stands in the way. Bouncer looks at Yuito. Hey, kid. What are you doing in a place like this? Got ID? I'm in my 30s. I don't have one. Not my rules, little guy. Gotta card you if you look below 40. Well, why don't you make an exception? No, kid. Come back with an ID. I'm looking for memories. It's a time-sensitive thing. Memories? What are you talking about? This is a club. You don't know? Well, just get out of the way. Can't do that. Come on, move it. We're both wasting time. You're not even real anyways. What do you mean I'm not real? Like being hit by a spell, Bouncer begins to shake. I... I... can't... Ah! The bouncer is fucking murdered. Wow. Yuto stares in silence. He's gone? Dead? No. Just a memory. A visualization. The way to the club opens. You totally didn't just murder anyone, Yuito. It's fine. With 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 his words. Don't worry with his about disbelief. it. Wow. For some reason this is making me think of the intro of the original Star Fox. All these simple, simple lines going on. Mm. I've never played that game, so I cannot confirm nor deny. It was fucking weird. A tall, professional-looking man turns to look at Yuito. Uh, uh, whoa, you new around here? He says. 
Uh, yeah. Is this a memory? Uh, yes. I'm manager. You? Yuito. Manager looks confused. Oh, you. This is my father's memory? You're his, uh, son? Heard you might come. Got it in here, even without an ID. Is he here? Here? Kind of. You'll see. Meet me fourth floor office when you're done. Okay. Manager walks away deeper into the club. Why did he know what a memory does, but not the bouncer? Interesting. Interesting. Do I, do I have to jump on here? Nope. Do I just go forwards? Oh, there's a circle. Oh, it's just a go upward. It's just a staircase. Yeah. Wow, this is a lot of people to talk to, mm -hmm. but I'm ready. Yuito's father sighs. Uh, mom? Oh, oh, I see. His father yeah. is calling her mom. I see. Yeah. Okay, Yuito's father sighs. Uh, mom, this suit looks really stupid. His mom is folding laundry and smiles. Oh, you look fine. Oh, wait, no, it's his mom. Of course, it's his actual mom. Yeah. <laughs> this is a memory, Tony. I don't know. His mom is folding laundry and smiles. Oh, you look fine. Are you all ready for the dance? No, mom, it's huge. Do I have to wear this? I need to be like at least five inches taller to wear it. Yes, your dad rented it for you. The mother sits down her laundry. But between you and me, you can just take it off once you're at the dance. Just take a few pictures in it for your dad. I think he wants to see you in it. Okay. Yuito's father looks at himself in the mirror, trying to pose as if it uh, as if it will make the clothes fit. Oh, yeah, I've been there, buddy. Yeah. Oh, too real. A Japanese-looking boy is sitting on a bench alone, scrolling through his phone. He's wearing a blazer, dress shirt, tie, and khakis. They don't fit. He's thinking to himself, "Ugh, damn it." I should, but I can't, I should, I need, this suit is stupid. He puts down his phone and looks down at the ground, moping. She doesn't have a date, but I bet she's dancing with some guy. Not fair. I can hear his thoughts? Is this my dad? Yuito looks at the boy and begins to speak. Uh, dad? Hello? Gotta ask her to dance. Can't. What if she says no? Gotta... No, no. But what if she says no? Why am I so scared? You Yuto shrugs and thinks. Guess he can't hear me. His suit... Oh, I His see. suit really doesn't fit at all, though. But I have to admit, suits really are annoying to wear. Yeah, that's real. Man, I used to wear suits in high school. It was Ugh, a bad idea. I have never once in my life worn a suit, and it makes me a little bit sad inside. Uh, Mal, precisely 38 days from now, you're going to wear a suit. Wow, that's great news. I'm just, I'm just telling you the truth. Wow, God, sometimes your predictions are good, and I love it when that happens. Yeah, I'm into it. A school janitor passes by Yuto's father and stops. Hey, kid, you all right? You've been here for an hour. What? Um... Yeah, I'm fine, the boy says. Yes, sir. How's the dance going? Bad. The janitor looks concerned. Oh, no. Why's that? It sure doesn't sound concerned. I don't know. It's just bad. The boy's friend walks over. Hey, why are you talking to me? Uh, sorry. Why am I making this voice? Hey, why are you moping and talking to Mr. Cooper? I'm not moping. The friend laughs. Mr. Cooper, he's all sad because he couldn't dance with any of the girls. The janitor responds, Hey now, watch it. There's nothing wrong with being scared. This dance is way too much pressure for boys. What? But not for girls? <laughs> there are plenty of other ways to build your confidence outside of an old tradition. Plus, it's more the parents that want to see it happen than anything. But you didn't hear that from me. Yuito's father grins and looks at his, at his friend. That's right. See? It's just a dumb tradition. Yeah. Yeah, hell yeah, Yuito's father. Fuck traditions. Does, does he have a name yet? Nope, I think he's just dad. Presumably this is the dance floor. Yuito's father looks to be about 16 years old. He picks up a glass bottle full of clear liquid. Oh, is this vodka? Father's friend nods. Where are we going to drink it? Father asks. The friend looks at him funny. 
Oh, uh, basement? Now? Father says. He pauses for just a moment, then says, Okay, um, yeah, give me that shot glass. Oh, the peer pressures. Yeah, Yuta's father looks stressed. Damn, man, no matter what, I just can't do it. I've got no game. Here, give me a shot of that. Yeah, really, another one. Hurry up. God damn, I don't know. His friend looks at him. Come on, man, it's now or never. Okay, I'm going. Well, what'd she say? His friend says. The father looks upset. Nothing good. Forget it. Let's leave. I don't want to be here. These parties are kind of just, they're stupid. Nah, man, what are you talking about? You just need some confidence, the friend says. I'm sorry, I've dropped the friend voice. That's fine. The father's on the phone. No, no, yeah, no, there's like nothing to even talk about. When we go to dinner, we kind of just sit there and that's it. How long can I talk about my boring job for? Books? I haven't read one of those since college. It doesn't really matter. Just forget it. All right, I gotta go. I've been standing in this bathroom too long. Damn. All right, the timeline's getting very unclear. Is it? I think so. Hmm. Uh, so yeah, like I was saying, I thought the sequel was really good too. I mean, I think the characters were a little weaker. You know how sequels always are. But still, the plot twist at the end was enough to make it worth it, and it was entertaining enough. You watch any of his films? The father's date responds. Uh, uh, uh. The woman picks out her food. She looks up from the food. Oh, no, I haven't. Both the father and his date are silent. Oh, oh. dating is hard. Yeah, it sure is. I, I feel you, Yuito's father. I feel you. Oh, God, where are we going? Uh, you know, I... I have literally no clue. We're looking at a bunch of geometric shapes. Yeah. Yeah, Yuita, Yuita looks at the ground. Ugh, just a bunch of weird childhood and dating stuff. Kind of annoying. Can't even talk to anyone, too. This is all memories have. It's a little disappointing. I wonder if I can even find another memory outside of here. Yuito sighs. What do you mean disappointing? This is like weird, wild, techno-magic bullshit. Well, Yuita's also living in, like, what, like, 2040 or something right now? The far future of 2040. <laughs> I don't know. Mal, it's you. Oh, I love being a, an amorphous blue figure with weird fingers. I love it. Honestly, that's how I've thought about you since the moment I met you. Yeah, since the moment we first saw each other. The manager appears out of the darkness. Well, feeling nostalgic? Yuito looks sternly at the manager. Uh, didn't really meet him. Awkward childhood memories. The manager laughs. Oh, disappointed? You ought to be thanking me. What? I let you into my club. Well, technically your bouncer did. You killed my bouncer. Made him disappear. About that. Well, he's not real, so? That arrogance is a bad look. He matters to me. I manage this memory. You destabilize this memory, cutting its life short. When parts of memories disappear, they are forgotten and disappear. Yuito stares down at the manager's desk. So what you're saying is... This club will soon cease to exist. The door locks. Yuito turns to try and open the door. What? Get me out of here. You're crazy. Are you scared? How do you think I feel every day? Memories in a memory world will always fade with time. So what are you mad about? You sped it up. Why do that? Let me out. I don't care. I, it was going to happen anyways. You even said so. Oh, Yuito. Yuito punches the manager in the face. Damn. The manager slumps down onto his desk, unconscious. Like the bouncer, the manager begins to fade away. And as he fades, Yuito can hear a rumble. The rumbling grows like an earthquake, overwhelming Yuito until his senses fail him. Wow. All our Asia. Are we dead now? A transmission from Doctor. Uh, Yuito, I picked up on stress. Has there been destabilization? Yeah, something weird happened in a memory that looked like a nightclub. I got into an argument with, with someone, and they just disappeared. A moment of silence, and then Doctor speaks up. You need to get out, then. 
No, not yet. I need more time. That memory was interesting, but it was just a taste. Just a taste of the memories. I think I can find more. <laughs> you tell you're putting yourself in a lot of danger. Your mother has even called and... Yeah, but I'm paying for this, right? My mom... Tell her not to worry. I mean, my safety is up to me, so... Doctor interjects. Sometimes we can't know everything about someone, and you can research your father's friends. Come on, Yuito. I'm sorry, Doctor, but I need to know more. Secondhand won't be good enough. Yuito stares straight into the laptop, focusing on Doctor. Don't Do worry about me. It'll be fine. It's not your responsibility. It's been fine so far. Yuito, stop being so stubborn, and... Yuito switches off the laptop. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Yeah, let's get a look at this laptop. It's, it's just a laptop. Switched off. The switched off laptop. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Is that like the memory pillar? All our Asia's. <laughs> All our Asia's. I don't know what it is. Ugh, Dad, you made it so hard to find you in real life, and even in this place, I still can't find you. All you've done is upset Mom, even when you're dying. I bet you're a real jerk. Why am I even bothering with this? Well, where else is there to go? Definitely not Advent Station. Hmm. Wasn't there another path in that desert leading to the forest? Maybe there's a memory there. I like how it leaves the text down there. Yeah. The entrance isn't working anymore. <laughs> I like how you read that as though it was a signpost. <laughs> well, it, it's true. It's not there anymore. No, it's not there. You're right. All right. Um, so we can, I guess, go back to Advent Station. Mm -hmm. Oh, or the highway. Or to the next episode of All Our Asia. So wow. thanks for watching, everybody. Hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed the video. Uh, you should also think about checking out our Patreon. It's there in the end card and in the video description. All right, bye, everybody. Bye.